Sri Delhi. So I'd like to wish you uh, that great auspiciousness to all of you um, taking this opportunity with the, in connection with the Thanksgiving as well as the upcoming uh, New Year. And I'd like to say a word from the Wisdom Tantra. Tashi kunje tashi ba takbe tashi nyendaki. Unje chambu kadende kajon romu chambu de kudrim dupusum so. So with this, I like to wish everybody very, very happy prosperity to upcoming new year. Healthy, happy, and a longevity to all. And uh, similarly, with the Thanksgiving opportunity, I'd like to thank you for yourself putting efforts to help yourself to develop yourself, to cut our own negativity uh, as much as we could. And even a little bit, we try to cut it down. And uh, by doing that, we are also building up a little bit of a positivity here and there. And uh, particularly all of you. So being try to be kind, compassionate, caring person, remembering that every morning, remembering that every noon, remembering that every evening, remembering that every night. So the 24 hour within the, your lifetime, you try to have the influence of love, compassion, and the caring within whatever you do, whatever the chores that you may be engaged in your daily activities. So many of you have tried that. So I'm really grateful for that and uh, that. I'd um, like to thank you for that. Also remind us to do the same thing for this upcoming year, so that at the end we will be the winner rather than loser. So to make ourselves a winner, uh, that's what we have to win. How are we winning by doing this? Because negative or afflictive emotions have been reduced so that positive or virtuous emotions and activities are increased and thereby creating a positive karma deed and the which will bring positive result, thereby reducing and rather eradicating negative karma and thereby the sufferings been removed from our vocabulary and that's we owe ourselves a thank you for our deeds. So I'd like to take the opportunity and do that as well as the whole our world. Uh, we also did quite okay. We not, did not really uh, blow up completely. We could have, could have, uh, but, uh, but we did very good. So I'd like to congratulate and thank you for saving the world from the point of environment, from the point of, uh, uh, from the clutch of hatred and uh, all that. So which I really think uh, we deserve 
to congratulate to ourselves. Then thinking of our own individual matters concerned, uh, to begin with, and uh, we had a very good winter retreat on the Guru Yoga projects of Benchangola Motongaba on the on the hundred deities in the land of joy. And uh, we had a very profound uh, basic study pushing uh, Guru Yoga is the backbone as well as uh, a backbone of our spiritual part. So we began with this. As well as we did, the, we have the summer retreat, the, uh, the uh, Bodhisattva's way of life, both oral and teaching transmission uh, completed within the summer retreat itself. And um, then looking back year before, we have done the liberation in uh, palm of your hand, uh, both oral transmission as well as a brief teaching. Um, we have done that. So looking back, we have done quite good uh, over the year, and particularly last one or two years, very strong solid of uh, uh, of uh, of uh, um, of uh, wisdom, uh, whispering tradition, teaching uh, within the uh, within ourselves, quite well done, and uh, particularly this year, the Jalochu Rinpoche visited. Uh, visited um, us and uh, spent about 15 days with us and uh, giving the, again, oral and the teaching transmission of Njangwon Lama Tsongkhapa's about essence of eloquence, which is wisdom uh, teaching. The essence of wisdom teaching along with the 16 drops of Kadam tradition. So, which was very fortunate, wonderful, touching with our tradition, touching with our own lineage and uh, tradition and all that. And that's why we are very happy. As well as uh, this teaching, uh, we've been able to to, to offer a free of charge, uh, which is the goal of ourselves to try to do the teachings are free of charge. Um, over the years, we really wanted to do it, but we have a great deal of difficult to do that. So this year, we've been able to do that, as well as our winter retreat upcoming winter retreat is also offering a uh, free of charge and uh, which is very happy, at least at the beginning of uh, what we can do, little bit of free of charge here and there. The whole purpose is uh, so be able to do that and we are grateful uh, to make to people who made it possible to be able to do it. And I would like to thank them too. And uh, as well as, uh, as uh, upcoming year, uh, and uh, the past year, when we look at ourselves, we are a little better than year before. We really try to engage ourselves with the activity of love and compassion. And uh, we try to remember the love and the compassion in the morning. We try not to forget love and the compassion uh, during the active working period during the day. We did not forget 
love and compassion in the relaxing period of the evening. And uh, we engage ourselves in the thought of compassion and love. Even our relaxing sleeping time too. Thereby we try to make ourselves 24 hours worthwhile and a worth for spiritual part, worth for, for our great human life, worth for benefiting for our self and our friends, and worth for fulfill the wishes of other well wishes. So that way, where we really do appreciate and also reminding ourselves we should do the same thing next year. Also try to be even better. So by engaging ourselves in the thoughts of love, compassion, morning, evening, day and night, which really cut the opportunity for those negative afflictive emotions a to grow two even if to grow to be strong uh, three even if it is strong it doesn't last so this opportunity cuts uh, those negatives and um, the afflictive emotions and thereby building positive deeds. Those who have not grown try to grow with us. And those which is developed with us to have a further development. And those who have a little better development become strong and effective. Those who have a strong and effective may be able to bring fruit to our lives and lives and to benefit all and uh, to all beings. And that's what we try to engage. We would like to urge you all to do that. Uh, and uh, that be your New Year resolution. And uh, try to keep your resolution alive. Uh, and uh, so that uh, we ourselves benefited. So I'd like to take this opportunity to um, remind you that and to thank you and uh, wish you very, very happy uh, New Year and uh, also enjoy the holidays. Thank you.